In this video, I'm going to talk to you about creating Shari. You mark out the areas on the on the wood that you would like to to work on. Once you have marked out these areas, use a, a heavier drill bit or a heavier cutter to clear off these larger chunks of it could take a little bit of a while to do that depending on how much of a trunk area you have to clear away. Once you've done the coarser work you can then move on to the detailing or the finer work and get more refinement into the dead woods. Once you've created the the inner areas you then start uh, coming back to the outside and and dealing with the creating the finer details on it which usually means following the grain on the on the wood that you've just exposed. Uh, you could use a scalpel or you could use Dremel if that's helpful. Creating shari is not something that you should take lightly. Uh, once you've committed to it, you need to understand that you need to protect it. So use uh, lime sulfur, um, wood hardener or whatever other materials available to you to try and protect uh, the wood. I propose that you let the wood dry out slightly before you actually start using the lime sulfur on the wood because so that it doesn't spread deeper into the core of the, the trunk. And that's how you create shari on, on bonsai.